In this episode, we will be exploring Shepherd Book's past from Firefly. First off, this video has spoilers. If you haven't seen the movie Serenity or if you plan on reading the comics, I wouldn't watch this video. If you want to read about Shepherd Book's life in full detail, I suggest picking up the book Serenity, The Shepherd's Tale. It is a graphic novel published by Dark Horse and was released November 3rd, 2010. The tale of Shepherd Book isn't a happy one. As a young boy, he was known as Henry Evans and lived with his extremely abusive father in a small apartment. Every day upon coming home, he would hope his father was asleep so he could listen to his music and escape into another world without the fear of being beat. One day, while listening to his music, Book was brutally choked and punched in the face by his father. Deciding he finally had enough, Book packed a bag and left his apartment for the last time. From there, Book grew up in a life of crime, stealing to make ends meet. He became very skilled at fighting and looking out for himself. He ended up getting a bit of a reputation, and after being noticed by the resistance and impressed with his skills, he was given the offer to join the independence movement against the Alliance as a volunteer. He initially refused until the cops beat down his apartment door, and he realized without the money to get off world, he had nowhere left to run and was stuck in a meaningless life of crime. After joining the rebels, he offered to become a mole for them, infiltrate the alliance, go up their ranks, and internally report on and sabotage them. This involved removing his eye and putting in a fake one with a thermal-powered camera and microtransmitter. It also involves stealing another person's identity by less savory means. Book, once inside the Alliance, quickly moved up the ranks, impressing officers with his brilliance, dedication, and ruthlessness. Eventually, Book is highly trusted within the Alliance ranks and creates a grand operation to end the war in one day by landing transports on six different planets. This is, of course, a complete disaster, since with his robotic eye, he transmits all the information to the independence movement and they were able to ambush all the transport. This is said to be the single greatest disaster in Alliance history, causing Book to be discharged and immediately released into space on an escape vessel. After being jettisoned out into space, he lands in a desert and is lost for quite some time either having the independence or alliance to return to. Finally, after a being kicked out of a bar and being kicked in the face by a soldier, he ends up in a soup kitchen and has an epiphany about the universe and everything being united. From there, he staggers into a church with a neon glowing cross and stays in the abbey for over 10 years trying to find God himself and his purpose. At one point, he finally, looking at the cortex and seeing all the suffering and pain in the world, thinks that it's time to rejoin the world and help others who are lost and suffering and in pain. Book wanders a shipyard and ends up running into Kaylee, and we know where it goes from there. <laughs> 